Why did the toucan stop using the phone? I don't know, man. Why? Why did the toucan stop using the phone? He got a big bill. Hello, hello. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Hi, Pi. I hope you have had a bloody marvellous day. Well, as you can see, I found a joke, in most people's opinions, and some not so much, about a toucan. So that inspired today's, well, I don't really know what it is, but it's certainly got a toucan in it. A team are meeting this morning. Classes, first class wasn't till midday, and then another class at two through till six. So team meeting finished or oh, round about just after night, just before 10 maybe. And I needed to record a video for the 12 o'clock class, Technical Literacy, to do with Excel. So yeah, I got that done and then drove on into town. Well, to the campus. What a beautiful day it was. And did my tech no, it's not a tech, maths class. Did my maths class with Excel. Got that all done. That was good. They were filming some promotional videos uh, in the same room as us. So there was a few little interesting things to look at there. And then it was upstairs to put on my steel cap boots, grab a bit of gear, and out in the field for the afternoon to uh, do some more leveling, which we got done eventually. Um, I did the booking, and I actually uh, made a bit of a dog's breakfast of it, to be fair. But um, we got it sorted in the end, and back into the office for just to tidy up the tidy up the admin, mark the roll, and that sort of thing. And then I came on home, sort of free, or feeling free, because I didn't have any work to prepare for tomorrow. Oh, I got some petrol on the way home. And uh, then, yeah, got home and mowed the lawn, mowed the little bit of lawn out on the street. It took me a little while to get motivated and get out there and do it, but I did get out there and I just enjoyed it to the max. It was just, I don't know, very relaxing. I did a lot of thinking, came in a much better person. And then, uh, yeah, into my social media <laughs> Playing with Terry the Toucan. So, yeah, bloody marvellous. And here's the numbers. Five, one, six, seven steps. Very good. Six hours of teaching, three hours of admin, and 83s for the weight. If you know anything about kurtosis, you will know the answer to this question and put it in the comments below the video. For a chance to be on the Hall of Fame. And today it's Moz42 from far north Queensland that takes a place on the Hall of Fame for knowing or alluding to the answer of a Schiffner is a piece of furniture. Bloody marvellous Moz and thanks to all the other commentators. You're all doing very well, and I appreciate your support of my channel. Cheers. you legit. This has been a Mario presentation, recorded live in our studio at Narawahia, Aotearoa, New Zealand, the land of the long white cloud, a place where Kiwis live in a paradise we like to call God's own country.